friends, it's me Kid Bowman, and welcome back to our channel once again. I'm so glad you can join me this part of this film review. After our, so after I have seen my review about Sonic the Hedgehog since last month, um, which is I'm glad you enjoyed my review of my Sonic the Hedgehog. It was fantastic, really. So I'd like to break down uh, a latest film with you updates from last week so um i went to see um a film called the call of the wild i th it was being it was being produced by disney and also um 20th century studios um so um i th it is a week it is the first you might be aware of that is this a remake of the original 1935 classic of Call of the Wild. It was originally distributed by 20th Century Pictures. It was before it became 20th Century Fox, really. So, I like this. I thought you might criticise uh, if its name's been changed by Disney from 20th Century Fox to. 2070 studios. I know it's a bit confusing to hear this. Um, let me show you a logo which compared to the original Fox film logos before it changes around almost 85 years. And um, I think I how 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 it, how it changes for years after it became 20th Century Fox. Uh, so uh, it was originally owned. That was owned by Disney Company. So let's move on to. The, some people might recognise some familiar actors in the part of, in um, in this part of the film. Perhaps I might recognise like you might you know Harrison Ford right? He portrayed as John Bonton, and also he, he plays. He was in Star Wars films, and he was in Indiana Jones films. I think that's a really good actor he is. And also, there's a few cool stars that may appear in this film. It was almost shy, and Dan Stevens, and Cameron Ginian. She she was in Doctor Who and Marvel Universe. She, is, she plays um, Nubia. I think you might recognise her. How, um, I guess how, um, this film was, dis how, um, film really looks like. If I, you might quite be unaware about, you know, you know a cow's name, a dog named Buck. I think it's been made in CGI. You can see how, um, the actor, it was John F Jack Fonte. He was provided as um, acting and motion character for Buck character. Uh, you know some similar cat. You know some familiar dogs in through Disney films. Okay, so there is some dog, some um, fictional dogs you might recognise in Disney. There is some um, Hadrian Man Dimensions. There was Pokemon and Purdy, and there was Lady and the Tramp, and there was Nana from Peter Pan, and Pluto in, in most Disney cartoons. In, you might recognise him from most Disney cartoons, really. Okay, so you know how um, box office has been less about. 54 million dollars their success oh because of Sonic's Hedgehog's been doubled up on the box office after a um, first after a um, video game adop, adap, adaption was completely successful and um, I guess I'm mean, still enjoy that movie so far last week and um, uh, thank you so much for your time to 
watch past this film, this video, and don't do not forget to subscribe to my channel to hit the notific no latest notification. And um, you can also follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest, and my Facebook page. And do not miss out the latest content to share. Also, you might see it through um, social links. You can find me on just beneath of this video description below. And um, and thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoy my um, film review about the Call for Wild film. I guess I'll see you soon. Take care of yourself, guys. See ya.